I'm going to show you how I start doing direction work and teaching the dog arm signals with retrieving. Start very simply and move forward in tiny little steps and if you're methodical they'll learn fairly quickly. Jersey heel. Heel. Sit. So choose a straight line to work against, a hedge or a fence line to help the dog take a straight line to its dummy. Sit. I'm going to walk the line that the dog will run so that not only would she have um, the memory of where it's gone but she's going to have foot scent to follow. Remember this is the very first time she will have had arm signals to teach her where to go. Sit. Brrr. Take the line back, sit, and don't go too far from the dog when you first start this. And she'll sit and wait, out, there she come, dead, good girl, good girl, heel, When I first start, sit, I always go and pick the other dummy. And in fact, you can start with just the one at the very beginning. So you only put out the left hand one, you just send her to the left, and then you only put out the right hand one and you send her to the right. And then you start to do both of them. Because clearly um, a really novice dog would be slightly confused to have the two out at once. So you build up all the time sit. The next few days later, when you've done that and you feel the dog is rock solid on it, don't walk the line that they are going to run. So you take away the um, advantage of foot scent. Jessie, sit. Mark. And it goes a bit further. Sit. Out. Be very clear with your arm and your foot and your whole body. Dead. Come. Sit. Sit. Remember, it's not necessary in any competitive work with HPRs to make them present the dummy at a sit. So for them to bring it in and give it to you gently is fine, but it's a good idea in training and to get them to sit afterwards. By making them sit when they're delivering the dummy, it can often make them bite down and become slightly anxious about it.